I don't know if you can hear me because um, Alexandra and my dad have the TV so loud, but we went to the doctor today and they put my glucose monitor on and it looks like a little Tamagotchi attached to my stomach. I'm waiting for the app to load. It takes like two hours to load your glucose. I'm curious to see how this goes. Me and Alexander have been doing inventory all day. We have a bunch of clothes I put on sale. We still have Birch merch. Um, I had to fix my website, if y'all didn't know. So it's thebirchfamilyllc.com. Our office is also just destroyed. There are things just everywhere, randomly, on the floor. So we're gonna go through and organize all of this, get all this cleaned up and functional again. The office is semi-clean. I got my sewing machine and everything back where it was supposed to be. Sleeping kitty. Everything's a little bit cleaner. I kind of organized the shelves. And then I've been playing with sewing my little shirts again. I did stay weird on this one. And then I think I'm gonna sew these little pieces on there oh, to make it super cute. I feel like we were so productive today. We got all of our inventory done, cleaned the office, filmed a little bit, and I'm exhausted from just that little bit. I'm giving a huge kudos out to pregnant women in their third trimester that like work a nine to five on their feet all day. I can't even fathom how you do that. You must be a cyborg, I don't know. I got my Dexcom today and it's like sore. I bumped it against the counter a few times and I thought I was gonna cry. These pajamas, they don't look very appealing right now because I've worn them to death. They're from Target, so comfortable. I love them. The more I have washed them, the softer they have gotten. I'll see if they're still available and I'll link them below. If you're pregnant, looking for some good jammies or not, if you're not pregnant and you want some good jammies, I love these. I have a OB appointment tomorrow because now that I'm 29 weeks. I go every two weeks, so it's my two-week appointment tomorrow. I think that's all I have to do. <gasps> oh, the baby's kicking. According to my app, she's pretty big, and she's supposed to be, like, up in here. I never feel her up here. She is always so low. She's always down here, or, like, around my belly button. When I feel her, I can feel her, like, roll around and stuff. I never feel her kick my ribs. She's always pushing on my bladder or pushing on my like intestines. We're at the doctor to get the baby checked. Oh my gosh, look at all the cat hair on me. Alexander's shirt is inside out, but she don't care. <laughs> my pants are inside out too. Your pants are too? Oh my gosh. I just, why do we go out in public looking like this? just got up. Well, I was gonna say by the looks of me, I just got up, but I look like this all the time. So you would never know when I just wake up. I just made some breakfast, like eggs and one piece of toast because my blood sugar dropped like super low this morning. And then in the middle of the night, my alarm started going off that it dropped super low too. So I was tired, I did not sleep last night at all. Also did not do a good job of filming yesterday but we didn't really do anything except go to the OB and then I have to go back to the doctor today. <laughs> I go to the doctor all the time. But today I'm going to see the nurse practitioner that handles my gestational diabetes, which I'm happy because my blood sugar has been dropping so low. Alexandra is having her morning conversation with all of her friends. Good morning, Rustin. Oh geez, here comes my sister. Good morning, sister. Hello. There's my sister. Good morning, friends. My sister says good morning, guys. Look. <laughs> good morning. She loves you. I love her. She loves you, Laura. <laughs> okay, bye. I am going to start a roast. Oh my gosh, this morning. So it can cook all day and then be ready this evening. We have some orders we have to fill, so thank you guys. Oh my gosh, I could totally take a nap right now and I just woke up. I have this roast that I have browned. I'm doing the mushrooms. My helper. Let's just take another bath. Let me see. Take another bath. Oh my gosh. Yes, I'm doing it right now. 
this is Alexander's second bath of today, and it's like 10 o'clock. Y'all, this roast recipe is my absolute freaking favorite. It does have to cook all day, but I'll have it in the description box if y'all are interested. It's so good. Can you feel her? Yeah. Oh, she's kicking. I think she's just rolling. Oh, she is moving a lot in there. So tomorrow you'll be 29 weeks. Mm-hmm. We got sister over here working. <laughs> it's been so long. What you listening to? What? What are you listening to? Why right above it. Oh. Miss Pamela Barton got three headbands and some stickers. Michelle Kane getting these packed up and shipped out today. Oh, put your hand on your hip. Put your hand on here. Oh, yeah, that sexy mama, you. Oh. Look at this delicious roast. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be so good. Today was another day of going to the doctor. Yay. Tomorrow is my first day with no doctor's appointments. What'd you do today? We did video uh, uh, fills today. Fillings? Filled orders? Yeah. When you say fillings, it sounds like, like dental fillings. Oh my God. I'm trying to cheer Alexander up because she's in here crying, having an emotional conversation with her friends. But sister's here for you. I know. Yeah. That kitty's trying to make you feel better. I know. Look how sweet that kitty is. I'm gonna mute someone. Oh, the drama. That's you. I just got to my office and had the sweetest surprise of all time. So Lilla, all the way in California, sent me a present off my baby registry. Um, and it says, congrats, I've been part of the Birch family a bit before you got engaged, fellow vet med folk. So excited for you and your family. And it is so sweet. It just, it really touched my heart. Anyway, so if you're watching this, thank you so much, Lilla. I love this so much. I didn't even know it had this design on it. I thought it was just green, but I love it even more. She got me a nursing cover. And I am so grateful. Thank you so much. Your thank you card is on its way. I'm gonna mail it um, today. So thank you. It was such a sweet surprise. Oh my goodness. Oh, my baby's really kicking. She says thank you too. Cause she's kicking the crap out of me right now. I just ran in the grocery store to grab like two things. I was in there for maybe five, 10 minutes. Okay. And Rustin has the worst separation anxiety. <laughs> And Alexandra sat in the car with him, and now she's very upset. <laughs> Tell him what you said. He needs to go where? To freaking doggy therapy. How is that funny? It's funny. How is that funny? It's annoying as heck. My husband has joined a softball team, and this is his second time playing. So we're going to go watch him play adult softball and it's super fun to watch a bunch of adult men who haven't played sports in 10 years try to run around and play softball hi <laughs> but it also brings me such deja vu because i used to watch him play baseball when we were in high school which was 11 years ago do you remember that uh-huh He's right over there playing second base. Alexander started her period and is not in a good mood today. Sister. What? <laughs> you don't think this is fun? <laughs> You're doing such a good job. I'm a horrible singer. Well, I can't reach that good anymore. <laughs> I am grocery shopping and since I 
have gestational diabetes, I can only eat so many carbs. I guess since I'm like paying closer attention to it since it affects my baby, how many carbs and sugars everything has. But oh my gosh, everything has so much sugar in it. So some of this is for my husband, like the kids, obviously. I got a bunch of blueberries and fruit. I am loving these ice creams to help my sugar cravings because I only have five grams of carbs. I'm gonna do some spaghetti with spaghetti squash instead of noodles. And then of course, Zevia because I love them. I am finishing up some things before I head home for the evening and go to sleep. That is it for this vlog of just random stuff throughout this past week. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know if y'all like this vloggy type video and we'll keep doing them. It's definitely fun for me, especially when it comes to the baby because then I can look back and see like, oh my god, look at her kicks or, you know, like I could completely forgot that Alexander shaved my legs because I couldn't even reach my toes. I love vlogging, but let me know if you guys enjoy watching it. We do have a munch pack coming in soon, so we'll start those videos back up, hopefully within the next week or two. As always, stay weird, and we'll see you in our next video. Bye!